Hi, this is Ryan with uh, Blair Technology Group, and today we're going to be looking at how and why to reset Internet Explorer. Um, reason you would want to reset Internet Explorer typically is if you have a bunch of toolbars or a bunch of add-ons that uh, software has installed uh, over the period of using your computer. Typically when you download software, especially free software, uh, you can run into some issues where they clog up your browser with a bunch of junk you really don't need. And the easiest way to set Internet Explorer back uh, to fresh factory default settings is to just go ahead and use the reset feature. And in uh, this video, we're going to show you exactly how to do that very first thing we want to do is go ahead and go to the start menu here in the bottom left hand corner go ahead and left click on the start menu uh, once we're in the start menu we want to go over to control panel here on the left hand or I'm sorry on the right hand side uh, go ahead and left click on control panel uh, this will bring up adjust your computer settings window uh, now in this menu we'll want to go ahead and uh, get into network and internet here left click on this green link uh, this will bring us to uh, some internet options, uh, this bottom option here. So we'll want to go ahead and click on internet options, which will be the uh, bottom link in green. This will go ahead and pull up the internet properties window. And the uh, very first thing you'll see here at the top will be your home page highlighted in blue. Right now it's set to MSN dot com or the default uh, you can put in whatever you want google.com yahoo.com uh, whatever page you know you feel comfortable with uh, if there is something you don't recognize in there you'll want to go ahead and click use default like i just did and that'll that'll reset it uh, back to the default home page if you do change your home page you will want to left click on apply down there in the right hand corner i didn't do it in this video here but uh, once you got the home page set you can just go to the advanced tab this will be the last tab here on the right uh, once in the advanced tab we want to go down to the bottom and you'll see this box here that says reset dot 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 uh, this is what you want to click to actually reset internet explorer once you do click this, it'll bring uh, this warning page here. Are you sure you want to reset your Internet Explorer settings? Um, we obviously do. So this it gives you a list of things it's going to reset. And you'll see in the middle there, there's a checkbox, so remove personal settings or delete personal settings. This will go ahead and delete all of your cookies, uh, internet files. Uh, it will also delete any passwords, save passwords you have for websites. So if you do have a ton of passwords, you might not want to take this option. Uh, if you don't have a lot of stored passwords, then this is definitely the most secure route. So you'll definitely want to go ahead and check this box. Uh, once you do have this box checked, you can just go ahead and hit reset again. And this will actually uh, activate the reset process. You'll see this uh, these four green check marks. Uh, that means it's complete. Doesn't take very much time. And once you see these uh, four green check marks, you can just go ahead and click close. Now we'll want to reopen Internet Explorer. There's usually a couple ways to get to Internet Explorer. As you can see, I have a link there on my taskbar. Uh, you can also go to the Start menu and then uh, under All Programs. Uh, typically, there is a link to Internet Explorer in the Start menu as well. Uh, once you do locate that, you can just go ahead and left click it and it uh, will pull up Internet Explorer. might take a little bit longer than normal after the reset, but should still only take a few seconds. Once it does come back up, it's going to pull up this first startup window, typical with uh, any new install of Internet Explorer. It's going to ask you if you want to use recommended settings or if you want to customize your settings. Uh, we probably recommend you just go ahead and click OK. Now, once you click OK, this, this will complete the process. It's going to bring up another tab here with some meet your new browser window with some video links to basically tell you a little bit about Internet Explorer. You obviously don't need to watch these if you're familiar with it, so you can just go ahead and close this tab. This will conclude our video on how to reset Internet Explorer. Um, this 
basically just turns everything off, all the add-ons and everything, but it doesn't actually remove them. Uh, we will have a video uh, posted on our YouTube as well as linked uh, on our support site on how to go into Internet Explorer and clean out all the junk as well as into add remove programs in the control panel and basically get rid of all the garbage so you can really clean up your system uh, and uh, that should be posted here shortly so definitely keep an eye out for that if you run into any issues or have any questions certainly feel free to give us a call we can be reached at uh, 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time Monday through Friday at uh, 855 Blair TG Again, that's 855-BLAIR-TG. Uh, I uh, hope this video helped, and uh, have yourself a good day. Thank you.